What's up guys, it's Devin Crop with DC Health and Fitness. Right, so today I'm gonna be talking about how fitness can change your life. First and foremost, you're gonna be changing how you feel. You're gonna be coming at life with a higher energy level, more happy, less stress. You're gonna, everything that you have bottled up in your life, any drama, any gossip, anything going at work, any family problems, you can hit the gym or run or whatever you're gonna do as far as your exercise and you can release all that out. Exercise all of that out of your system. Okay? Also, you're gonna be conditioning your heart and your muscles and you're just gonna be you know, living life a lot more free. You're going to be able to do funner things. You're going to be able to rock climb, or, or, you know, ride a bike, do all these things at a higher level. And you're going to feel so much better doing so. Okay, living life with the more less stress, less internal conflict, and just a healthier. You're going to feel so much better. That's the number. That's the first one. That's the first tip. Is you're going to feel so much better. All right. So that's that's a huge thing. Number two, you're gonna live a higher quality of life. Okay. okay, imagine now, you've been living, let's say through your 22. You've been living your 22 and you haven't really been exercising, you haven't been eating healthy, you haven't been living that fit life, okay? You might feel okay now, but when you're 27, you're gonna be like, okay, oh, I'm starting to feel more. When you're 32, when you're 37, you're gonna start feeling it more and more. Imagine now you start fueling yourself with the right foods, recovering better, living a healthier lifestyle, exercising, conditioning yourself. By the time you're 32, you're gonna be feeling like you should've at 22. There's plenty of people who look amazing, feel amazing, and live a high quality of life at 40, 50, 60, and 70, still exercising, still killing it. Look at Mike Tyson. You can talk about all the drugs and everything like that, but you cannot deny that living a healthier lifestyle, fueling yourself and exercising right, you're gonna be living a higher quality of life. And you're also gonna be enjoying life more. You're gonna be able to go on runs, play with your kids. Um, once you have kids, you're gonna be able to do funner things, mountain climb, mountain bike, dirt bike, at a higher quality. You're, gonna, you're not gonna get worn out as much. You're gonna have more energy uh, and to live a higher quality of life and do the things that you wanna do. Number three. Three is you're gonna be living longer. I look at my dad, he's like 40. Look at my grandparents, they're like 60, 65. And I already know from the lifestyle choices that I make, living a healthy lifestyle, a fit lifestyle, exercising, eating healthy, I'm gonna be, by the time, I'm gonna be in better shape and a higher quality of life and live longer than my grandparents. At 75, I'm gonna be feeling like I'm gonna still look better than at 60 because of the lifestyle changes that I'm making now. Okay, so it's going to, what you do now is going to affect your entire life. The habits that you build now, the lifestyle choices you do now, exercising, eating healthy, and not doing such bad things to your body, your temple, the thing that you're enjoying and expressing yourself through this life. And this is, the, this is very important, all right? You don't wanna abuse it with drugs, alcohol, fast food, processed foods, and you know, sitting on the couch and not exercising. I'm not saying you can't do, you know, splurge a little bit and have some fun sometimes, but, you should be treating yourself right. Like, cause you truly love yourself, right? Cause if you did, you'd be treating yourself right. But the point is, is you're gonna be living longer, okay? Instead of dying at 75 or 85, you might die at 85 or 95 at a higher quality of life, okay? You, you can't put a price on that. Number four, all right, what's number four? Number four is you're gonna have more. If you look at me, I have all types of energy. I'm running off three hours of sleep, baby. And I'm not talking about like I should only, you should be getting seven or eight hours of sleep. Honestly, you should. And I should have, but I couldn't fall asleep last night for many reasons. I'm not going to go into it, but I only got three hours of sleep. And you see me, I still got this energy. It isn't really fake. Of course, I want to be high up for this video, but honestly, I have plenty, a lot of energy right now. It's because how I feel my body and I exercise and I make good lifestyle choices. I don't get drunk. I don't smoke weed. I don't, you know, I don't, I, I work out three, four, five, six, seven days a week. Okay. I move around. I walk, I run. Okay. I move. I express my body. I do yoga. I eat veggies. I eat my greens, I get my berries, all right? You're gonna have more energy when you're doing these things. The, the do whatever you want. If it's spending more time with your family, if it's to make memories with your friends, if it's to make more friends, if it's get girls, if it's to achieve ambitions and goals that you want in life, whatever it may be, you're gonna have more energy to do so. Number five, you're gonna have more confidence, higher self-esteem, higher self-respect, better self-love, more pride in yourself. Because you're treating yourself right, you're fueling yourself with good food. 
nutritious food that's gonna make you live longer, higher quality of life, more energy, make you feel better. You're gonna be feeling so much more confident, so much more self-love. You know, and, and you're achieving something because if you start doing these things, exercising and eating right, not only are you gonna feel better and have more energy, all that, but you're gonna look better, okay? You might not, it depends on your goals and what you're willing to do, but you might not have the six pack or the big muscles or whatever, but you're gonna look good, better, regardless, regardless. And that's something you achieved within yourself, okay? You're gonna look in the mirror and you're like, God damn, Devin, God damn, Jay, God damn, Barry, Adam, whatever your name is, you're gonna be like, God damn, I'm killing it. Okay, that's how you're gonna feel and you're gonna have higher self-respect for yourself because you know that you're treating yourself right. You're fueling, you're recovering, you're training. You know other people aren't, your friends aren't. And it's not so much a comparison game, but you're feeling good about yourself. Like I'm doing this, I'm killing it. I'm having a great life. I'm feeling myself right. I'm exercising, I'm living a fit life. So you're gonna have higher self-esteem, higher, more confidence within yourself because you're accomplishing something and more self-love, more self-pride because you're you're doing what you said you were going to do. You're going to set a goal. I'm going to lose 20 pounds and you did it. You're going to set a goal. I'm going to start eating this much more greens every day and going on a 20-minute walk and you're doing it. You're going to have more confidence within yourself, more self-love, more pride, higher self-esteem. And that's honestly the most important one. Number five is the most important. That's a circle. That's a star right next to it because that you cannot put a price on. Okay, because we're having more confidence, more self-esteem, it's gonna help you with relationships, friends, any goal you want. You know, go to the park and make a video and scream, whoa, and not care, right? I mean, that doesn't really matter, but, but, you have more confidence. That's, you can't put a price on that, guys. I highly suggest living a fit and healthy life. Okay, there's so many more tips to go over, but these are just five that I hope you find useful. All right, here's a quick overview of the five reasons why and how you should live a healthy life, how fitness will change your life, okay? Number one is that you're gonna feel better, okay? You can't put a price on that, you feel better. You're gonna come out, you're not gonna feel so tired at work. You're not going to feel so tired or grumpy with your parents or the dog or at the grocery store or at the park or whatever. You're gonna enjoy life better because you're feeling better, all right? Number two is you're gonna live a higher quality of life. You can't, what the? What, why not live a healthy fitness fit life and start exercising going on walks and runs and eating right when you're in a you're gonna feel better and you're live a higher quality of life when you're 50 60 70 you're still gonna be killing it grandpa grandma you're gonna be killing it you're gonna be killing it I see a lot of 30 35 40 year olds that have kids and are like, oh I feel so old I'm like cuz you don't exercise and eat right I don't see the 40 year olds eating right and exercising and look fantastic complaining about their kids are too hyper. Because, you know, yeah, kids are gonna be hyper than you when you're 40, of course. But you're, they can keep up. They're not gonna be like, no problem. When you're 35 and you smoke a whole bunch of cigarettes and you drink and you eat a whole bunch of processed food and you don't work out, of course. <laughs> you're like, oh, I feel like I'm getting old. Of course. Because you are, you're killing yourself. Okay? Not the, not, I don't, you live your life. Live your life. Number three. Okay, you're gonna live longer. What would you do for an extra five, 10, 20 years? Is it worth eating more veggies and going on some walks and working out and doing some yoga? Is it worth it? Yeah, it is, in my opinion. Okay, number four, you're gonna have more energy. More energy, okay, obviously. Woo! All right, number five. Number five, baby. Number five, man. Five. More confidence. Number five, you're going to have more confidence, higher self-esteem, more self-respect, more self-love, more pride. Because you're treating yourself right. You're recovering, you're sleeping better, you're feeling better, you have higher energy, you're living a higher quality of life, less aches, less pains. You're making PRs, progress, you're looking better. You're like, God damn, Devin. God damn, Robert. God damn, Luis. You're looking fucking good. Oh. Hell yeah. Number five, you're going to have more confidence. Those are five reasons on how fitness, fitness can change your life. All right, this is no game, this is no joke. It absolutely can, it has for me. In my seven years of training, it has multiple times elevated my quality, my energy in every single way. And I guarantee I'm gonna be living forever. <laughs> Immortal. <gasps> okay, take me serious. And it's done it for many of my clients. Many of my clients, the so training in person, uh, when I was an impersonal trainer and with my online clients now, and I've just seen it in general, fitness will change your life, okay? It can change your life. If you're willing to let it change your life and be dedicated to eating healthier and exercising and living a fit lifestyle. So that's how fitness can change your life, guys. If you like the video, 
comment, share, like the goddamn video. You let me know what type of content you want to see in the future. It's going to be around fitness, lifestyle, healthy, um, living, uh, empowering you guys, inspiring you guys, and educating you guys from my experience and what I know and how it can change your life. So if you like the goddamn video, like it, comment, share it to your friends. If you find somebody else, you know, might get some use from this video. I hope you guys find it useful. Comment down what you thought about it. Other than that, guys, this is Devin Kripe with DC Health and Fitness, Coach DC. Check you guys next time. Peace. <laughs>